uh, now how to set up the um, thank you page this part here where the raffles are showing up through uh, the templates so in order to do that you need to go into your uh, folder system and inside the teams inside the teams folder you have to have your child's team not the main you always have to have a child's team okay inside the child's team you have to create the folder called woocommerce and inside that includes and inside that templates okay once you have this folder system remember not in your main theme in the child's team you have to go into uh, the plugins uh, folder and select uh, raffle play U includes templates and then you can actually select all the templates here or the one that you actually want to customize which in our case is going to be the thank you and the email and we're gonna paste that into our templates includes WooCommerce so every time that I'm if I'm gonna make a, a new update a new release and I'm gonna you're gonna update the plugin this this folder and file is gonna stay here okay so the first thing the plugin is gonna look into this folder try to grab this file if it doesn't exist it's gonna look into the into the in the plugin okay so to customize it you can go in in it right if you make any mistakes and things go south okay you could actually delete it and copy it back from the uh, uh, from the from the raffle uh, folder system okay back into your uh, child's team WooCommerce includes templates okay so in here you could actually do uh, so let's have a look uh, this is how it is and if we want to change the border to color red where uh, border color <clears throat> uh, where the t uh, the raffle name is displayed uh, and here you go that's how you do it uh, you could actually add some CSS stuff if you want to so somebody asked me how can I actually add some images in here uh, okay so in order to add some customization like image uh, let's say after the raffle I'm gonna create a new row I'm gonna add some images uh, in order to do that uh, you could actually just down here you could create another ticket uh, no, raffle image raffle image uh, custom and it's going to be empty and you're going to say if so it's going to be based on raffle okay so we have the raffle id at the top here and we can say if raffle id uh, zero that's going to be the default okay uh, or you could do something like int uh, this is a safer way if it's zero okay I want my raffle image custom to be equal to I'm gonna grab this one here be very lazy I'm gonna grab a new row and I'm going to change this part here to be uh, an image uh, source equal uh, sorry image source equal and I'm gonna go up here and I'm gonna select nice image I'm going to select an image <clears throat> and I'm going to paste it down here and I'm going to close that and then I'm going to say style equal uh, height of 100 pixels okay so now okay uh, else uh, 
yeah i'm not gonna put an else i'm gonna use only for the default raffle okay so for the default raffle so in here i can say now ticket info and now i'm gonna append it i'm gonna append that image okay raffle image custom okay so if the raffle id is equal to zero for the default or i could say here else if yeah and raffle id equal uh, equivalent to 27 was it the win i think so yeah uh, so here we have custom image for win samsung okay samsung samsung okay so now uh, our image it should display as a row in the default so uh, if I go here, refresh it, and oh, it goes above it. So if I wanted to have underneath, I would just go copy this text, Control X, Control V, and that's it. Okay, and that's going to be displaying under Win iPhone. That's that's how you have it. Of course, you can do any other uh, customization here. You know, it's up to you. So the fancier, the one like you have you have full control over the templates. Uh, for the PDF templates, I would suggest you to be very careful because they can easily break. So if you are confident and if you want to make some changes and then test it, uh, it should be all fine. So that's that's how you actually do all these changes. So all this part here where it displays it displays the raffle information for the thank you page and the email. Okay. Um, if you have any other questions, if I missed anything that you want to look at or um, just drop me an email at developer@tasco.com or um, in the comments below on um, YouTube and I'll try to uh, respond to them. All right. Uh, thank you very much and see you next time.